September 11, Saints Protus and Hyacinthus martyrs. Not much is known of these two martyrs, save that they were brothers, and they are honored on this day among the most illustrious martyrs that ennobled Rome with their blood, when the emperors of the world attempted, with the whole weight of their power, to crush the little flock of Christ. Pope Damasus put an epitaph over their tombs and called them brothers, and informs us that Hyacinthus sustained the first conflict, but that Protus obtained his crown before him. They are said to have been retainers to St. Eugenia, also a martyr who is honored on the 25th of December. Their martyrdom took place at Rome around the year 257. Their relics now reside at St. Basilia in Rome. What words can we find sufficiently to extol the heroic virtue and invincible fortitude of the martyrs? They stood out against the fury of those tyrants whose arms had subdued the most distant nations, to whose yoke almost a whole world was subject, and whose power both kings and people revered. They, standing alone, without any preparation of war, appeared undaunted in the presence of those proud conquerors, who seemed to think that the very earth ought to bend under their feet. Armed with virtue and divine grace, they were an overmatch for all the powers of the world and hell. They fought with wild beasts, fires, and swords. With a wonderful cheerfulness, they braved the most cruel torments with humility, patience, meekness, and constancy. They baffled all enemies and triumphed over all men and devils. How glorious was the victory of such an invincible virtue, having before our eyes the example of so many holy saints. How are we yet so dastardly as to shrink under temptations or to lose patience under the most ordinary of trials?